Hello. How are you? I hope you will be fine. I am a graduate of National Textile University Faisalabad. And today, I am going to tell you some basic questions and answers for spinners that will help you in interviews. So enjoy this video and give comments about this video. Please introduce yourself. My name is Shaquille. I am a textile graduate from National Textile University Faisalabad. Okay, I am going to ask you some basic questions regarding spinning. What is spinning? The process by which yarn is made from fiber. Tell me what is fiber? Fiber is classes of materials that are continuous filaments or are in discrete elongated pieces, similar to lengths of thread. They are very important in the biology of both plants and animals for holding tissues together. What is textile fiber? Textile fiber has some characteristics which differ between fiber to textile fiber. Textile fiber can be spun into a yarn or made into a fabric by various methods including weaving, knitting, braiding, felting, and twisting. The essential requirements for fibers to be spun into yarn include a length of at least 5 mm, flexibility, cohesiveness, and sufficient strength. Other important properties include elasticity, fineness, uniformity, durability, and luster. That's very nice. Now tell me what is yarn? Yarn is a long continuous length of interlocked fibers, suitable for use in the production of textiles, sea wing, crocheting, knitting, weaving, embroidery, and rope making. Okay now tell me about flow chart of carded yarn manufacturing process. Fiber, bale, blow room, lap, carding, sliver, draw frame, roofing, yarn, winding and packing. What process or machine is used after carding? Draw frame. What process is used after draw frame? Process used after draw frame is simplex. What is the production of blow room? Production of blow room is lap. What is the production of carding machine? Production of carding machine is sliver. What is the production of simplex? The production of simplex is roofing. What is the production of ring frame? Production of ring frame is yarn. What is one pound? One pound is equal to 840 yards or one hank, or 0 0.4536 kilograms, or 453.6 grams, or 16 ounce. Okay, now tell me what is fiber fineness? Fineness is one of the most important parameter, determining the yarn quality, whether it is fine or coarse. How fineness is specified for cotton? Fineness is specified by Meikoner value for cotton. You are going very well. Now answer me. The maturity of cotton is defined in terms of the development of cell wall, yes or no? Yes. What is staple length? Staple length is the average length of spinnable fiber. If staple length is increased, then yarn quality is also increased, yes or no? Yes, yarn quality will be increased. What is the minimum strength for a textile fiber? Minimum strength for a textile fiber is approximately 6 cn slash tex, about 6 kilometers breaking length. Okay, now tell me what is fiber elongation? Elongation is specified as a percentage of the starting length. What is bale management? Testing. Sorting and mixing bales according to the properties of fiber for producing specific good quality yarn, at minimum cost is called bale management. What are the basic operations in the blow room? Opening, cleaning, mixing and blending, and finally, even feed of material to the cart. Very good. Now tell me what is what is carding? Carding may be defined as the reduction of an entangled mass of fiber to a filmy web by working them between two closely spaced relatively moving surface closed with sharp wire points. What are the objectives of carding? To open up the cotton into single fiber state. To reduce the number of neps or short fibers. And to produce a thick and twisted rope of fiber called sliver. What are the main objectives of draw frame? Straightening and parallelization of fibers by drafting and drawing. Minimization of irregularity by doubling. Blending and mixing of fibers and to produce a more uniform sliver of definite weight per yard. What are the faults of blow room? Soft lap, conical lap, barrel shaped, split lap, ragged selvage, and lap licking. 
for cotton, higher the count, finer the yarn. Yes or no? Yes. What is the meaning of TPI? TPI is turns per inch or twist per inch. Okay, now tell me what is roving? A roving is a continuous slightly twisted strand of fibers which has not received its final drawing for yarn. Roving hank equals 0 0.70 to 0 0.85. TPI equals about 1.15. What are the faults of yarn? Irregular yarn, thick and thin places, slubs, nept yarn, spinners double, crackers, bad piecing, hairiness, soft yarn, hard and not elastic yarn, and rough yarn. Over twisted yarn become poor in strength, yes or no? Yes. In direct system which one is fixed, mass or length? Mass. English count is denoted by A and E. Yes or no? Yes. Name the types of fiber. Types of fiber are normal fiber, thin walled fiber, and dead fibers. What is tenacity? The tenacity of a fiber is the mass stress at break. Its unit is gram, per, tex. What is twist of yarn? Twist is the spirality of bundle of fibers or filaments. There are two types of twist. Z or clockwise and S or anti-clockwise twist. What is the moisture regain of cotton fiber? Moisture regain of cotton fiber is 8.5%. What is IPI? IPI indicates yarns thick places, thin places and slubs. What is count? Count is a numerical expression which indicates coarseness or fineness of yarn. Or, count is a number indicating the mass per unit length or the length per unit mass of yarn. Well this is extraordinary knowledge you have got. Now tell me what do you mean by one li? One li equals 120 yards. What is difference between cotton and viscose? Cotton is natural fiber, strength is increase in wet condition. Will of viscose is man-made fiber, its strength decreases in wet condition. What is doubling process in spinning? The process of combining several sliver info one is called as doubling. What is core spun yarn? It is a continuous filament polyester core, wrapped in cotton fiber. What is pitch in spinning? Pitch is the distance between adjustment spindles. So, I hope you have learned a lot from this video. If yes, then share your views and comments and subscribe my YouTube channel Textile Magazine for more informational videos.